I don't know if he was joking because he <laughs> told me when I'm connecting. Do you, I don't know if you remember this, but your father just showed me a baseball bat in his car. Yeah. Yeah. He was a tough cookie. Christina Dite Rich, is it Dite Rich? Hi, Matt. Yes, Hi, Dietrich. Christina, Christina how are you? Dietrich. Good, how are you? Good. Where are you guys from? We're from Jersey. Oh, good. Well, first of all, I'm glad that you guys are here. Thank you, Thank us you. too. Now, right away, first of all, um, is this your mother with you? Yes. Okay, because right away, I keep hearing I'm the father. So, first of all, mm -hmm. that was your dad that passed away. Yes. Mm -hmm. And know that he's here and that he's with you, because right away, I saw your dad lean over and kiss you, and he wants to let you know mm -hmm. that he's here. And you know, your father was a tough guy here in this oh. world connected with him because he yeah. said to me that he goes I didn't believe in this shit here in this world all right yeah. he goes but I would have done anything for my family all right yeah and listen Christina I don't want to get you get in trouble here all right I don't know if your dad had like some mob related my ties God. over here <laughs> oh my god but he showed me the mafia when I'm connecting <laughs> he always yeah. like joked about that. I don't know if he was joking because he <laughs> told me when I'm connecting do you, I don't know if you remember this but your father just showed me a baseball bat in his car. Yeah. Yeah. He was a tough cookie. <laughs> your, your father shows me like when people used to screw around with them. I literally see your dad being like, getting out of the car, opening the door, yeah. getting out of the car, going to the back, getting the baseball bat, all right? And getting out and like getting ready. All right, you want to start something? Come over yep. here. Right? <laughs> that was my father. That was my father. Yes. He shows me him all dressed up on the other side. Like, even though he had the baseball bat, whatever, he's dressed up in a suit. Like, he could be coming yes. from, from church or whatever, all dressed yeah. up. Somebody gives him a hard time. He goes to the back. He gets the baseball bat. <laughs> over here. And your mother was like a saint. Because I hear yes. your mother saying to him, like, calm down, calm down. Yes. Don't yeah. be so busted. Don't do this. Don't do that. Do you understand yes. that? Absolutely. Yes, absolutely. I'm going to tell you something. Your father, not only is here, he does tell me. He goes, Matt, he goes, listen, I wasn't in the mob, but I had to do a few things sometimes, he tells me. Oh, my God. <laughs> do you know about this? Because he says to me at one point, they would use certain things of your dad's. Like they'd, they'd, say to your, they'd say to your father, listen, can you go and run this down there? He would make he would make drop offs, he tells me. He tells me at one point, am I saying too much? Am I not supposed to be no, saying? No, 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 it's fine. <laughs> no, I she said no more than I do. No, so. I know, go on. What do you mean you know? Why, why, why is this so hot? Listen, you, every, your father's saying to me, because I'm saying to me, is there, is there, am I, is this going to be an issue? I'm asking your father. And you got, your father goes, everyone's dead now. There is no issue. Right, right, right. <laughs> well, the mob died. Everybody died, he says to me. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, it's true. It's but true. He, my father was, my father was not a big guy, but he, you didn't want to mess with him. You didn't want to open your mouth. Like he would fight you like, like nobody's business. So like I used to joke around and call him Napoleon because he wasn't a big guy, but he was ready for a fight at any given moment. And it's funny because your father goes to me, Matt, he goes, I wasn't a bad guy. He's, but this is what you did back then. He goes, you, he yeah. goes, you, he, you were to show people that you weren't afraid that you couldn't be pushed around. He says, right. yeah, he goes, you know, I was asked, he says to be in the mob. He goes, that was never my thing. He goes, but when right. somebody comes to you, he says, and they ask you to do a favor. He goes, and, and they got those connections. He goes, you do it and you don't say a word. Right, right. He grew up in Brooklyn and they were all, you know. Yeah. Oh, no wonder why. Because yeah, he's <laughs> acknowledging that. Here's your father, right? He's cracking me up, this guy. First, he's showing me threatening people with a baseball bat. <laughs> me in the kitchen cooking when I'm connecting with him. Yes, yes, his yes. father was a hell yes. of a cook. Yes, yes he was. Very he showed me he's got all the all the all the fresh Italian meats. All right. He's got the salami. He's got the yes. sauce, yes. the mortadella. He's got all this stuff, right? He used to yeah. make himself a little like like meals and things. Yes, yes. absolutely. Mm -hmm. But that mm -hmm. was him. And your father was like the fixer here in this world. You need something, don't worry about it. I got you. I I'll take care of you. And he mm -hmm. shows me that he actually loaned, you know, he used to loan money out to some of his family members. Yes. Help he his did. family members. Yeah. And you know what your dad told me? He says, Matt, he goes, I had to be this way. And I said, why? He says, because when I grew up, he goes, nobody ever gave me any, anything. Yeah, he says, yeah. I grew up, he says, being poor. He goes, I didn't have anything. Mm -hmm. He says, and right. we, I had to work. He says, for everything that I had. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah. It's true. He's talking about starting a business. Do you understand yeah. that? He goes, so yeah. when I opened up my business, Matt, he goes, I had to help everybody else out. He goes, that's just how I was. He goes, someone needed a job. I gave it to them. He goes, yes. somebody needed some, some cash or something. I gave it to them. He yes. goes, because that's how I was. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So true. So, so true. So no, he, no. he bought, he bought out, he started in a business 
there were six partners. He bought each of them out and then owned the whole place. Like yeah. he was, oh. he was a very hard worker and mm -hmm. he provided very well for his family. So know that your dad says to me that the one thing that he wants you to know is that you were the love of his life here in this world and you still are. Oh. He says, so, you know, even though he had passed, your dad wants to thank you for loving him the way that you did here in this world, for the way that you had such a strong connection with him. He says, because every single day that goes by, he says, I want you to know, he says that I'm still watching over you in spirit. And he's acknowledging that. And he's got this dog that's with him that's on the other side that he absolutely loved, okay? Moving, <laughs> moving. So no, it's his way of just acknowledging that, letting you know that he is okay. And more importantly, he is safe and at peace on the other side. Thank he says, God. so thank you for for loving me he says thank you for, for doing everything that you did he says i know that i'm always there oh great thank you so thank much. you so much matt oh you're so welcome